Hey, what's going on my friend out there on internet land? Welcome to the video. My name is Brando Linick and you're searching for how to start a bottled water company. Um, it's a great search. It shows me you're looking to become an entrepreneur, a business owner, and my story and experience with this, the whole reason why you're going to want to pay attention goes back over the last three and a half years. Having throughout that period of time started some businesses that worked, some that didn't work. And uh, I'll tell you, you know, from that experience, what to avoid, what to look out for. However, when it comes to a bottled watered company, the first thing you need to keep in mind if you want to start one is the overhead associated with the business model, all right? Because automatically, when you're looking at a company, when you're looking at operating a facility, uh, a water plant, when you're creating something that's of your own product and service, like a bottled water business, all right, in a company, you're looking at supplies, equipment, employees, and the operating cost to run that on a monthly, ongoing basis, but not just that, to start it. And I'm just telling you, having seen people do this and go get loans and finance from the bank to do it and then take 10, 20, 30, 40 years to pay off their debts, I wouldn't advise you to strap that ball and chain to your leg. If you're looking at starting a bottled watered company because you're looking at this to make money, all right, and you're looking at this to start a business, to be your own boss if that's what you're looking for. All right, I'd advise you before you consider starting a bottled water company, if you hear me out here for a minute, if that's really what you're looking for, all right, to be your own boss and to make money, I'm gonna throw at you a lead. <coughs> and my experience with this part of me goes back over the last 15 months when I transitioned from traditional business to an internet business, I came across a person who's building a business on the internet, um, doing so without creating their own products and services, without having to spend tens of thousands of dollars or hundreds of thousands of dollars on a facility to operate under or dealing with you know the expenses on a monthly ongoing basis of operating a facility or dealing with employees equipment supplies and because they weren't dealing with that making a high multiple six-figure income business online all right using the internet I started to model and copy what they're doing and in less than you know, 30 days I was able to create a full-time income business working part-time um, not average or typical results obviously <laughs> you know results are gonna vary and it's the same type of style that you'd have to put in a water bottled company alright you gotta learn stuff you gotta put in work but the cool part was I didn't have to fork out tens of thousands of dollars or hundreds of thousands of dollars and I didn't have to you know deal with supplies equipment employees and you know the operating costs to keep the business afloat on a monthly ongoing basis so if you're looking at this because you want to start a business to make money all right and I want to reemphasize this if you're looking at it because of that all right to do what you want when you want wherever you want not saying there's no work required not saying that the internet's the only way to go when it comes to building a business because if I told you that it'd be a bunch of crap but I will tell you this if you're looking at it specifically because of that you want to make money and you want to do so in a highly profitable fashion the best thing you could do I would advise you before you consider a bottled water company, all right, and starting a bottled water business, learn the skills required to building a business online. That way, you increase your profit margins and you decrease your overhead and your workload, all right, that's associated <coughs> with equipment, supplies, employees, and all that overhead. So I hope that makes sense. And the best tip I'll leave you with here is connect with someone. There's a lot of noise out there on the internet. On the internet, there's a lot of different businesses and systems and programs you could get started with. Instead of trying to test them out yourself and figure things out yourself, connect with someone. Connect with someone who's already building a business online, who's willing to connect with you. Um, it's what I did that broke me through. And if it can work for me, it can definitely work for you. So I appreciate you. It's been fun. And uh, if this did make sense and you want to learn more about how to build a business on the internet without doing anything technical, if you're coachable and you're willing to learn some things and you've got that drive, check out my site. It's 123marketingtips.com. I'll put a link in the description below, and aside from that, I appreciate you, and I'll see you on the beach of the world. Take care.